Let me ask you about uh, another issue, the coal uh, idea of coal extraction, gas extraction from the Firth of Forth. Um, what do you make of this plan? It could uh, could be a very large number of jobs potentially, I imagine, for, for this part of Scotland. Well, there's no doubt this seems a, a very significant discovery and it just shows the potential of this particular technology for Scotland. But of course, we have to look at it very, very carefully. We have to treat such possible technologies with the utmost caution. We have to see that precautionary approach in terms of protecting the environment. Uh, our environmental agencies would do that, our planning authorities would do that at the same time. So we'll see where this particular application goes, if it is actually lodged and taken forward, but we'll take a very precautionary approach towards it. Scotland's got an array of clean energy sources that we can deploy, and that's why when a new one uh, comes into the frame such as this, we have to take a very careful approach. I mean, this is natural gas. It's perhaps, a, you know, people would see that as a fossil fuel. Doesn't it undermine, then, your re renewable commitments? Well, clearly Scotland is very, very lucky. We've got an array of renewable resources and clean energy resources uh, in Scotland to, to power our needs of, of the future. So this seems to be a very significant new find, and we'll have to look at it closely. But in terms of all these new discoveries and new technologies that uh, some companies may wish to take forward, we have a very precautionary approach to make sure we can protect the environment, and our environment agencies and our planning authorities will certainly do that. So you're clearly not prepared to write this off. Uh, the green rules from the SNP government, not hard and fast, then? Well, the outcome we want to see, of course, is that Scotland deploys all our clean energy resources to power our needs into the future. We're a very lucky country. We're blessed with an array of energy resources, renewable energy resources in particular. So when a new technology comes into the frame such as this, which seems to be a significant find, we have to look at it very carefully, look at what the implications potentially could be for Scotland's environment. And that's why we'll take a very precautionary approach in terms of the way our environment agency and our planning authorities handle it.